We have partnered with the uh, Refugee Task Force, Lutheran Family Services Refugee Resettlement Program, and the Carolina um, Survivor Clinic, and we're working with the refugee population. We have um, about 10 refugee children in here this week that the Refugee Task Force raised money for eight of them, and then we had a private donor donate money for two others. And we've got children from the Congo, from uh, the Karen population, they're from Myanmar, and most of them had to flee to Thailand. And then we've got um, some Vietnamese. We've uh, gotten familiar with the Congolese children since April when they came to one of our Worlds of Creativity presentation, and we fell in love with them. The children are so joyful and full of life and energy. They've had a rough story. Um, the Congolese children, at about the age these are now, the girls would have been taken and been forced to be brides for the army, and the boys would have already been confiscated to be soldiers. So we've got them enjoying life in camp this week. And we've also got some of our American children in here, so we, you know, we're trying to encourage them to be friends it's a positive experience for everything. We're, we're very glad to be able to provide this opportunity for the children to interact with other American children. All these children are in school. Sometimes we, some of us need to step forward and let folks know their work. And we're doing our little small part in our little corner of the world to do that. <laughs>